This video demonstrates how to use the Diagnosis Center to identify and rectify network connectivity faults on RGWall 1600Z S Series Cloud Managed Firewall. The Diagnostic Center integrates various functions including traffic receiving detection, detection of basic configurations such as security policies and NAT policies, packet tracing, and traffic forwarding detection and provides a standard troubleshooting roadmap to help you locate network faults with one click. It also offers explicit and practicable diagnostic reports to achieve efficient and easy network troubleshooting. If a network interruption occurs after onboarding or during running of a firewall, the Diagnostic Center can help you locate the fault and find a solution. Now, let's go through the diagnosis process. First, traffic receiving detection is performed. Check whether packets from the source IP address are received. If not, check the network connectivity between the source IP address and the firewall. Second, basic configuration detection is conducted. Check whether the basic network connection configurations including interface IP addresses, routes, DNS settings, and security policies of the firewall are complete. If not, complete the configurations before proceeding. Third, packet tracing is implemented. Check the packet processing results of the security policy, intrusion prevention, antivirus, and other service modules. If packets are discarded by a service module, adjust relevant policies accordingly. Finally, traffic forwarding detection is performed. Check whether the traffic is successfully forwarded by the firewall to the extranet. If not, check the network connectivity between the firewall and the next hop. Consider a scenario where an intranet PC, with the IP address 172.16.2.2, is unable to ping an extranet IP address through the firewall. Here's how you would troubleshoot in the Diagnostic Center. Log into the firewall web UI and choose System Fault Diagnosis Diagnostic Center. Click Diagnose. Set the source IP address to the IP address of the Internet PC 172.16.2.2. Set the inbound interface to the Internet interface GU0-4. Select the protocol as required. In this example, select ICMP. Do not change the values of the other parameters. Click Diagnose. Read the prompt message and click Got it. Then the device starts to detect the network connectivity between the source and destination IP addresses. After each diagnosis phase ends, check the diagnosis result and details in the lower part of the page. After rectifying all faults in the current phase, click I have handled the problem. In the dialog box that is displayed, click continue. The device moves on to the next diagnosis phase until all phases are complete. If you have any questions about the detection result, contact Wagia Technical Support.